Hi, I'm Matt Souders, aka DJ Noji with Noji's Wedding Entertainment Services. Going to give you a quick tip for how to choose your DJ MC. Uh, first off, congratulations and good luck to all those brides and grooms out there searching. Uh, what I would do is I, I would ask as a DJ MC the couple, what are they looking for? Are they looking for a DJ MC who's laid back? Are they looking for a DJ MC who's in your face? Or someone to get the crowd moving? Uh, what is your family and friends like? What kind of music, what kind of genres do they like? Uh, those are good things to ask yourself before you sit down with the DJ and then figure out through personality, maybe on the phone, uh, video chat, maybe online. It's kind of hard sometimes to gather something online. So I try to do something through the phone or face to face if that's possible as well. Uh, you know, it, and it's kind of crazy that you think about an officiant can mess up a last name and everybody just kind of chuckles or whatever. Uh, but if a DJ MC messes up your name, that's a pretty big deal. So, with that being said, make sure you look at reviews, that's how I would choose my DJ, and then face-to-face -face or do some sort of phone contact or something to interact, just to see kind of how their personality is. I don't know if I would necessarily go to an event, um, I, I, personally, uh, because you might see someone who, uh, a DJ that is at a great DJ, but is providing service for somebody who wants laid back. You're something on the opposite end that wants something more in your face, so that wouldn't be a good match. So that's kind of rough. I necessarily wouldn't go to an event. I would more sit down face to face or do something over the phone. That's the, those are the questions I would ask. But first, ask yourself those questions and go from there. Congratulations, good luck, and I'll see you soon.